Hi, I'm Spencer Lupo, reporting from Lupo 3 News, and today we're going to talk about hurricanes. Hi, Spencer. Why are hurricanes so deadly? Well, hurricanes are so deadly because the winds of a hurricane are only about half as fast as those of a tornado, but a hurricane can be 2,000 times as wide. And while most hur tornadoes last less than an hour, hurricanes can rage for many days. What is the eye of the hurricane? The eye of a hurricane is the center of the hurricane. The eye is usually calm. The temperature is warm and sunny, but when the eye passes, the storm begins again. You know, Matt, our, our truck operator, Tom Bear, said, don't you wish you had your weight back? Right about now, I do. Oh. Oh. Are you okay? We're okay. We're okay. We're okay. Okay. We're okay. Okay, we're coming inside. Yeah, do yeah, that's that, a good Al. idea. That's Wouldn't a good idea. Sure we're back with more of today on this Monday morning. It's the 24th of October, 2005. That was Al Rowe. How do hurricanes form? Hurricanes start forming over the ocean as a group of thunderstorms near the equator. A tropical storm happens when several thunderstorms join together over the ocean in, in the tropics. The storms begin to spin together. If the spinning winds reach three, 39 miles per hour, it's a tropical storm. As the tropical storm drifts across the ocean, it picks up more and more moist, warm ocean air. It spins faster and grows faster. If the winds reach 74 miles per hour, it becomes a hurricane. The word hurricane comes from the Native American word hurricane, the name of the spirit who controls the east wind. Hurricanes are called by different names around the world. In the western Pacific Ocean, off the coast of China, they are called typhoons. In the South Pacific, off the coast of Australia and the Indian Ocean, they are tropical cyclones. And in the Philippines, they are vaquitos. All hurricanes start over the ocean. In the eastern Pacific, the first hurricanes of the season typically form in May. In the Atlantic, Caribbean, and the Gulf of Mexico, most hurricanes occur from June through November, with mid-August to late October being the most active time for hurricanes. A hurricane is a type of tropical cyclone, a general term used to describe a storm with bands of wind that cycle around and around. The spinning is caused by a swerving movement created by the Earth rotating on its axis. We call it the Coriolis effect. This movement makes the winds move counterclockwise in the northern hemisphere and clockwise in the southern hemisphere. Tropical cyclones are classified by their intensity. Tropical depressions have winds of 38 miles per hour or less, and tropical storms have winds of 39 to 73 miles per hour. Hurricane winds blow between 74 and 200 miles per hour or more. Hurricanes can cover a path of 200 to 600 miles wide. They can travel thousands of miles in a matter of hours. Scientists have said that 20 minutes of the strongest hurricane is equal to one megaton H-bomb. Are hurricanes the most dangerous storms on Earth? Yes, hurricanes are the most dangerous storms on Earth. In 1992, a hurricane in Florida destroyed more than 25,000 homes. In 1970, a hurricane in Pakistan killed more than 300,000 people. Every year, hurricanes cause billions of dollars of damage, of property damage, actually, around, around the world. In 2005, Hurricane Katrina caused an estimated $100 billion of damage, and at least 1,836 people lost their lives, making it the worst natural disaster in recent U.S. history. Spencer, what kind of damage do hurricanes cause? The worst hurricane damage is often caused by a storm surge. A storm surge is like a giant wall of water pushed onshore by hurricane winds. 
A storm surge can rise 20 feet above normal. That means every building near the ocean, shorter than two stories, will be underwater. Spencer, how do hurricanes get their names? Well, hurricanes have names so meteorologists can keep track of them. Hurricanes are named when they are still tropical storms. The first storm of the season begins with A. Each new tropical storm begins with the next letter of the al alphabet for the season, alternating from girls' names to boys' names. If a hurricane causes significant damage, the name is retired and never used again. Hello, this is Fedzi Lupo reporting from Lupo 3 News. Goodbye, everybody. Are hurricanes the most dangerous storms on Earth? Yes, hurricanes are the most dangerous storms on Earth. In 1992, a hurricane in Florida destroyed more than 25,000 people. I mean, home.